Since the Livic map was updated, it has caused much discussion amongst players. Today, we want to talk to you about the process of creating the Livic map. The origin of the Livic map actually came from a cup of coffee. PUBG Mobile is fun for sure, but sometimes it takes too long to play a game. I usually work long hours and have very little time to play. This is what our producer heard when he met this player in a cafe last year. Our producer had been thinking about the same idea already. Therefore, on the same day, he had a discussion with the development team. How can players fully enjoy playing PUBG Mobile with limited free time? After the discussion and some user research, they came up with an idea to develop a smaller map that takes less time and has a faster pace. Therefore, the unique map of PUBG Mobile Livic was created. Livic is only 2 kilometers by 2 kilometers, which is the smallest map in PUBG Mobile's classic Battle Royale gameplay. It takes only 15 minutes to complete a game. Players can win a chicken dinner in just 15 minutes and enjoy the excitement anywhere, anytime. Of course, besides the faster pace, as PUBG Mobile's new exclusive map, we must create more interesting content. The question that follows is, how to set the landscape of the map. We remember the scenes and experience when we went to Northern Europe for the first time during the trip. When we saw the very beautiful Nordic terrain coexisting harmoniously, we were amazed. We thought that we must find an opportunity to incorporate this unique and romantic landscape into PUBG Mobile. And then here came the opportunity. But we also faced many challenges. For example, presenting a landscape of snowy mountains, dormant volcano, Lupinfeld, waterfalls, and hot springs in a compact map and ensuring high visual quality. This use of image textures is three to four times more than that of other maps. But we don't want the players facing freezing issues because we made the images too detailed. Therefore, we tried to tackle this technical challenge. We tested various models and selected the color saturation that satisfied most players. We optimized the rendering efficiency and frame rate of vegetations to try to make various mobile phone models play smoothly. Our existing version has rich details and ingenuity while experiencing smooth and high definition pictures. Some players have discovered that when entering the waterfall, there will be a noticeable impact of water flow. We've considered and added similar real details and experiences in many places in living. Take the snowy mountain area, for example. From the top of the mountain to the bottom, the thickness of the snow, the distribution of vegetation, and the color of the grassland will have obvious changes per the elevation. We know that many players like to hide behind big rocks. <laughs> so this time, we made a drag show for the big stones. For example, where there's a lot of water, the stones will grow moss accordingly, and the stones next to Snow Mountain are wrapped in silver, and the experience will feel more realistic. In accordance with the climactic characteristics of Northern Europe, we have planted a lot of quilts, trees, shrubs, tundra, and living, which are distributed in various regions according to their habits in real life. When it comes to vegetation, we have to talk about the grass in the new map. According to the player's visual habits and tactical changes at different distances, we've repeatedly tested the height, density, and color of the grass. No matter how you look at the grass, be it from afar, up close, walking, passing, or climbing by, it will be a very authentic experience. The design of the turf roof is also very interesting. This kind of Nordic turf house has a fairy tale feeling. However, it is not as gentle as it appears. The roof of the turf house is a tactical anti-slope. The turf can also make people on the roof not so easy to find. What we really mean is that this is the official recommended ambush point. Remember to try it. Just like the turf house, appearance is important, and so is the entertainment aspect. We hope that the new map will be fast-paced, but the battle royale experience of players should be intact and exciting. Like the distance between resource points on the map, the farthest distance a player can see in any corner of the map, and the distance between field shelters. You can't roughly reduce the scale according to map compression, otherwise a bunch of things will be packed together and you can't play. We spent a lot of time adjusting these distances to ensure that players can get a positive gaming experience. We also found that players particularly value the combat experience of gun to gun and final circle in the small map, so we kept the same experience as the classic map in these two links by shortening the time of collecting equipment and transferring location. Make the new map more fun to play.
In the previous beta test, some players were very concerned about scoring in Livid. In response to this, we've done some deep thinking and made intricate designs to ensure that everyone is playing the new map and other classic maps will invest the same time and get the same score rate. Worry about falling points? Don't be, because they don't exist. Just enjoy it. However, Livic is a very different place than the other classic maps in regards to the maximum number of people. We've conducted many tests with the upper limit of 100, 80, 60, 50, 40, and on. The player's flow curve test data helped us determine the final maximum number of people in the new map. 52 people. Although the number of people is small, if there are very few resource points, it is still easy to get together and jump from the sky. Therefore, we have significantly increased the medium-sized wild spot so that you can decide if you want to play aggressively or stealthily. In addition, there are more gun choices. Livic has joined the submachine gun, P90, and the new sniper rifle, MK12. It can be used well. We believe everyone will be willing to take them into the finals. Well, those that watch this far are the true fans, so we've decided to tell you a few secrets. If you're attacked in the hot springs bath, don't worry. You will find that it is safe to squat down. This height can protect you. What you need to remember is, be careful of grenades. We specifically placed a motorboat at the edge of the waterfall. Ride it up, fly it down. You'll fall in love with this feeling. We increased the physical response of this large reed swing. If someone climbed over, you will see the reed moving. This time, we believe you'll understand what to do. There are many other interesting places. For example, hmm, please find out for yourself. For this map, Raphael Lim, the executive PD of PUBG Corp and head of mobile division, gave a very high valuation. Yes, Livic can give you a whole new experience. A quick and cool little map for chicken dinner. We hope you all like it. Thanks to every player who loves and supports PUBG Mobile. We will work hard to make more fun and engaging content day and night. We don't sleep, remember? <laughs>